22nd of um, March. So it's Friday. Yay! <laughs> and it's either... Um, it's seven days past trigger. It is um, five or six um, DPO. So, and I say that because six is um, six DPO if I ovulated on Saturday, so, uh, five DPO if I ovulated on Sunday. And I don't really know when I ovulated. I just suspect that I did on Saturday. So anyways, uh, yeah, I subbed today and it was okay, pretty boring, like it was hard to get through um, just because there was a student teacher in there and I, you know, I told him, I was like, so you're going to take the lead today, right? And he's like, yeah. So, because he, he knows, you know, the routine and everything of that class. And I have subbed for that class before, so they already knew me too. So... Yeah, um, my day was spent just walking around the classroom, just making sure that they were doing their work rather than talking or whatever. So, yeah, it was pretty boring. <laughs> so, anyways, um, I wanted to let y'all know about symptoms that I've been having and blah, 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 whatever. Um, Wednesday, I started my Prometrium. So, yep, good old Prometrium. <laughs> And I was wanting to ask, um, my Prometrium, excuse me real quick, did not come with any applicators. Now, I bought these on Amazon. These are uh, vaginal suppository applicators, and they're individually wrapped. And I really, really like them. <laughs> Better than having to use my hands or whatever to insert them. Well, I bought these off of Amazon. They only come two to a pack, and they're like six bucks. So I was wondering if anybody knows where I can get some in bulk. Um, I've looked online. I found one place, but I don't know. I'm weary about putting my credit card number in any non-reputable, reputable, whatever, however you say it, um, non-well-known like well -known websites like I want to make sure that they they're certified and they have um, they can either go through PayPal or whatever you know because I just feel more secure about it um, and the other one I couldn't find anything that said that so yeah um, so if anybody knows anywhere where I can get some more in bulk that'd be great if not I'll just order a whole bunch and spend like way too much money um, also, they're plastic, so I don't know if I could just like boil them or if it's fine just to run them under some hot water or whatever. Because, um, you know, I don't want to give myself an infection by reusing these, you know. They're disposable, so yeah. <sighs> um, I've mentioned in past videos that my breasts were really, really sore. Um, like right before ovulation or even right before I even triggered my breasts were really really sore um, that has subsided now um, the past two days when I take off my bra they're not really really sore they are a little sore but I have to actually like something has to be pressed against them or whatever excuse me for that to hurt so yeah um also, I mentioned it was seven days past a trigger, so I tested, I've been testing it out since I got back from uh, South Carolina, and this morning was a complete negative, so it is out of my system, so whenever I test again, that would be my final result. Um, April 3rd is my test date, unless I start to get some symptoms going on. Um... The earliest I got a positive was either 9 or 10 DPO, but by then, like, ugh, my breasts were killing me, and, you know, I had quite a f bit of symptoms, but right now I don't. So, I'm not really even thinking about it right now. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, I also wanted to mention, I 
am planning on making um, some like a series on what I do during my two week wait. Unfortunately, I tried to make one this weekend. Or no, it was this week. When was it? Wednesday. Yeah, I tried to make one Wednesday on my new upholstered headboard. I don't know if you can see that. But this whole blue thing behind me is an upholstered headboard that I made. Um, it was revamped from, um, it used to be a box spring of mine. And we broke it down and everything. And um, Wednesday I upholstered it and cut some uh, legs for it and everything. And I made a whole vlog on it uh, on my Nikon, my DSLR. And when I put the, the SD card into my laptop, not even the pictures were saved. I have no idea what happened. It's happened one other time, but I was so upset because I had seen the pictures and I had seen, like reviewed one of the videos and I didn't delete anything. And it just sucked because it was all gone. Like I was so excited to share it with y'all, but now it's all gone and I, there's no way for me to retrieve it because I have no idea where it's at. So yeah, I apologize for that. Um, if I do plan to do uh, other videos, but because I don't want to go through that whole thing again, I'm probably just going to record them on my um, Canon Vixia, which is my camcorder. Unfortunately, that my Canon Vixia will not really work very well with my laptop. Even if I save it to an SD card, um, it actually, all you can do is hear the audio. You cannot actually see the video, which sucks because to try to edit it, you have to be able to see the video. So, yeah. Um... Um, that just means that I would have to wait till April in order to post it from my husband's laptop unless I do go back to South Carolina again which I don't really plan to do because of how much it sucked this last time <laughs> so yeah um, but those would be coming up you know and that's also the reason why I'm not using my my uh, I usually use my Nikon to record stuff so, um, to record vlogs, and that's why I'm using my camera right now. It's because I don't want to risk making a video and not having it show up. Sucks. Um, let's see. That's pretty much it. That's all I wanted to really say. And, um, yeah. Oh yeah, I wanted to congratulate all the ladies that are having babies. It's so awesome to see all these ladies who I have been watching since the start of my journey, um, who had been trying a lot longer than I have, especially, um, you know, to actually, you know, become moms. And that's amazing and very inspiring, even, you know. So, yeah, congratulations, ladies. Y'all know who you are. And I, I'm excited to see, you know, more baby pictures and stuff. And hopefully a whole bunch of BFPs soon as well. So, yep, that's it for me. I will talk to y'all later. Um, and I'll give y'all any updates if there are any soon. And, um, yeah. All right. Bye.